set calendar sharing options. As an admin, you predefine what type of sharing options your users will have in their calendar. To configure it, go to your Google Admin Console at admin.google.com. On the top left click the main menu. Then go to Apps. Then, click Google Workspace, and open the calendar settings. Then go to Sharing Settings. Remember that by default, a user's primary calendar is not shared with people outside your domain. You can set up both, internal and external, sharing settings for your user's primary calendar. In the external sharing options, you can choose the level of sharing permissions for your users, from four set options. The only free, busy information option, only allows external users to see whether your calendar is booked or if you have free time, with no additional info such as names or event details. The share all information, but outsiders cannot change calendars option, will allow external users to see your calendar time zone, and subscribe to it to stay tuned whenever there are any changes or new events created. The share all information, and outsiders can change calendars option, additionally to being able to check the calendars time zone and subscribe to it, external users can add and edit events, including deleting and restoring them. The share all information, and allow managing of calendars option, in addition to all features mentioned before, external users can change the sharing settings of the calendar and permanently delete the calendar. On the other hand, in the internal sharing settings, you can configure your user's calendar default sharing option. With the no sharing option, your user's calendar won't be shared with anyone. With the only free, busy information, hide event details, option, this allows users in your domain to check when another user's calendar is booked or not, with no additional info. With the share all information option, your user's calendar info will be public for others in your domain. After selecting an option, always make sure to click save. You will get a confirmation message indicating that the settings were saved. Your users can now decide which sharing permissions they'll set for their Google Calendar. For more help, check out the Set Calendar Sharing Options page in the Google Workspace Admin Help Center. You will also find this link in the description of this video.